Okay, okay, I told you guys all to come in here, alright, alright? We are already making contact with everyone. We want to tell everyone that yes, Trilling Falls lawyer was rushed to the hospital. He was pronounced dead. We're gonna contact his family. I know that his brother, he works with him. We're going to contact him, all right? What the hell happened? Luke was doing an interview at approximately 4.15 p.m. After about a 30 minute interview with all of you reporters, he turned and he was immediately shot. The person that shot him is now in custody. I can confirm that. And through that door right there, he is inside and we are going to interrogate him. We're going to talk to him. Look, all I can tell you guys is this. That man murders someone on live television. You guys need to back off a little bit. I understand your job. I respect that. You guys are reporters. You guys have a job to do. I understand that. But I'm going to go through this door. I don't want anybody to barge in, try and get that one-of-a-kind shot, that one-in-a-million shot, $10,000 shot, whatever the hell you want to call it. I'm going to go through that door, and I'm going to interrogate the man that just killed the leading lawyer of this city. Go through that door. We'll talk to him. Right? What do you have in your hand? What I have in my hand is something that I found very interesting, and that is as soon as we got into the interrogation room, he said to give a piece of paper and he wants something to say to the media. I'm going to read it right now. It says that by the time I'm done with this interrogation, Luke will not be seen in the same light ever again. That's what he wanted me to tell you guys. I don't know what that means. That's what he wanted me to tell you guys. Why are you giving him the time of day after what he did? Look, it's a pretty open and shut case, but my big thing is that I want to understand why he did it. You don't just shoot someone on live television and you think that that is it. That just does not happen. And I'm going to make sure that by the time we're done talking to him, we understand what he did and go from there. All right, I'm gonna go in the room now. I'm gonna go talk to him. Okay. All right. Mister, I didn't catch your name. It's Jerry. All right. Mister Jerry, I want to talk to you about something. You obviously. You murdered someone on live television. Open and shut case. I understand that. You said you did not want a lawyer. I'm going to ask you again. Do you want a, a lawyer at any point? No. Do you understand what that means? This means that anything that you say will be used against you. And can be used against you. Yes, I know. Why did you kill him? Like, why? Especially on TV, why? You won't believe me. Try me. Luke and his family is not what they seem. They may seem to everybody else as the most powerful lawyers and attorneys in this city. But 
Baluk, his brother, and his family did something to my family. So I needed to seek revenge. Okay, what... What kind of revenge would... What type of thing would they have to do for you to murder them? For you to murder Luke? The reason why I murdered Luke... is because him, his brother, they killed my family. Wait, excuse me, the lawyer killed your family? Yeah. Do you have proof of this? Not on me? Just look at the evidence, I guarantee you. You'll find out.